What's up, y'all? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to customize your iPhone lock screen with all the cool new stuff in iOS 26. Apple dropped a bunch of fresh customizations, so let's get into it. First up, you can move your widgets down to the bottom of the lock screen now. Super handy, especially for one-handed use. Just hop into Customize Mode, you can do that by going into Settings, Wallpaper, and tapping Customize, or just long press on the lock screen. You'll need to unlock with Face ID or your passcode, of course. Then, just drag your widgets down near the quick action buttons like the flashlight or camera. Easy. Next cool thing, the big clock. Yep, now you can make the time on your lock screen way bigger. When you're editing, look for the little handle on the clock. Grab that and drag it to make the time really pop. It's clutch if you want it super visible. Got widgets on there? Don't worry, they'll just slide to the bottom so everything still fits. And if you're using a depth effect photo, iOS will automatically tweak the clock placement when you crop it, just like you'll see on the video. All right, third tip, faster way to switch up your wallpaper. iOS 26 now gives you a quicker photo picker. When you're customizing the lock screen, you'll see a mini version of the current photo. Tap it and boom, you get two choices. Either view that photo in your library or swap it out for a new one. Saves time, for real. Fourth feature, let's talk spatial scenes wallpaper. If you've got an iPhone 12 or newer, you're in luck. These wallpapers are kind of wild. They're like 3D style and they move when you tilt your phone. Look for a little cube icon on supported photos in your camera roll. It works best with pics that have people, pets, or stuff in the foreground. Tap it to turn on the effect. You can also move and zoom the photo to line things up just right, especially if you want the foreground to layer over the clock. Just make sure the depth effect is turned on, because that's what makes the 3D magic happen. And here's the crazy part. Even if your phone's not the newest, iOS 26 can use machine learning to turn regular pics into spatial scenes. Kind of nuts. Fifth thing, this one's for the music lovers. If you're using Apple Music, iOS 26 brings animated album art right to your lock screen. When a song's playing, just tap the album art and it'll expand and start moving. Not all tracks support it just yet, but Apple's adding more over time. Heads up. Spotify and YouTube Music don't support this feature, though. Next up, not new, but definitely useful. You can now change or remove those quick control buttons on the bottom corners of the lock screen. Don't want the flashlight or camera? Swap them out for a calculator, alarm, or whatever else you use most. Just go into Customize and switch it up. Seventh customization changing up the wallpaper style. Now it's even easier to swipe through styles while customizing. You've got options like natural, black and white, duo tone, and color wash. Want to go custom? Just tap the color icon and pick whatever shade fits your vibe. Last tip, you can now adjust your wallpaper with pinch to crop. That means you can zoom in or out to show exactly the part of the image you want, and iOS will auto adjust it so everything, widgets and clock, fits just right. So yeah, that's the rundown on how to give your lock screen a whole new look with iOS 26. Hope this helps you trick out your phone just the way you want it. Catch you in the next one. Peace.